Hi, and welcome to our channel, Nene and Sophia. I'm Nene, an adult doll collector. I'm Sophia, a nine-year-old, and I like to play toys. And welcome to our doll room. It is Friday evening, and I'm super excited about having a weekend. I just love weekends. And I'm really excited about um, just kind of spending it here with you and with all of you um, out there that um, maybe like dolls as much as we do because this is my happy place and it's been a busy week and so I'm super happy to be hanging out in the doll room and talking doll stuff tonight. I I love dolls so much. I like how you can like just like put your fashion onto other things except just you. Like you can put your fashion on dolls and you can make it different. Like sometimes you can't always like buy something because like they don't have it or something. Well, you can make something for your dolls just like that and that can kind of like be you wearing yeah. that. Yeah, and I think that that's, I mean, I think that that's why Barbie has had so many famous fashion designers yes. that have designed for her. I mean, like what other toy in the entire universe has had famous fashion designers want to design for her and make gowns and for their for toys and so I think that that's part of it I think a lot of um, people that are fashion designers talked about how they played with Barbie and that they made clothes for Barbie or made some fashions for Barbie and really got into fashion design that way and and that's why I like fashion dolls I like their fashions, I like their accessories. I just think that that's really fun. Um, and I've always been a Barbie person, but I have really been branching out into other things. And I'm thinking instead of having a doll room, I need a doll, doll house. house, like a house <laughs> full of dolls. Because with Monster High and Rainbow High, and they've, they're coming out in New Illy Forevers, I just think it's like there's just so much and that's one of the things we wanted to talk to you guys about tonight. We've got the new Venus McFly Trap doll who I think is absolutely gorgeous and we wanted to unbox her and just kind of talk about doll stuff, right? Yeah, and I also bought some things on Timu that we're going to show. That you want to show and we've got um, some mini brand books. I like, we had bought a couple of these balls mm -hmm. and opened them because um, we're wanting to do like a little bookstore thing. And then like you couldn't find them anywhere. Like they were on, yeah. they had them at Target and they, um, you could see them on Amazon for a really high price and Target just kept saying out of stock. So they finally had them in stock. So I got a couple and more. Last time we got like, like holidays, holidays, a book like. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. And we got, like, three of that. Yeah. <laughs> like, so we'll have to see what we get. Uh, this, I, I may not, I may not purchase a, a lot more of these. Maybe they'll come yeah. out with some different books. But there's also, a, like, Froggy Stuff has free downloads. And oh, yeah. I've got some downloads from Delightful Dolls before. That could be, like, a fun video. So a lot of people books. have, yeah, a lot of people have um, some free downloads for books. So, you know, we can probably fill our little bookstore with some things. You know what we need? So there's um like a it's kind of an app it's like something you can search on Google but you can make like it's like a word cloud mm -hmm. but we could like make a Barbie word cloud and like hang it up in the room. Oh, that would be very pretty. I think that would be neat if I can find um a couple inches of free space in here. I think we could under the clock, <laughs> under the clock <laughs> over there. We could we could maybe do that. Okay. Yeah. What do you want to start with? Um, I don't really care. Think? I think we could start with our mini balls. Pick one. This one. Okay. Alrighty, okay. let's see what kind of books we have. I've been, I've been picking up my emails all day today. So well, it's definitely open in the, that was really fast for me. That never happens. Perfect. Um, opening these. Um, I have to use my Because that's the only one I get pick at. That was unusually um swift for me <laughs> it went easy for both of us yeah i it's just rare. i just need to i don't know i need more room already okay i got mine 
So each ball has four packages um, of goodies. So we'll just have to see what we have here. Okay, this I'm one's really big, so I'm intrigued on it. So I think I want to start there. Okay, go for it. Let's see okay, what we got This one here. like feels kind of thin, but also it feels like it has something on it. I think this is one of the magnifying glasses. Oh, the, this, this is paper's a, a little part of something like that. This is one of the things that you put together. Oh, like a bookshelf or something? Oh. Oh, I got Shoot. my magnifying glass. Ooh, I love the little magnifying glasses. Those I are think super cute. It's like good for a detective fire. So, magnifying glass. I love it. And oh, it's um, Roll Doll, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. But it's not Willy Wonka. It's Roll Doll. That's the author. Oh. Ronald Doll. Yeah, well, maybe. It's, uh, is the author but guys this is so cute i love how much detail and on the like first page you can actually like read the book yeah some uh, after you get past the first page or two it's it's words so they have actual pages but it's kind of like gibberish maybe it's like, like maybe it's no, it's I, just like the ink didn't all finish like there was like not much ink yeah left. like you can't see the words okay so this is like a little bookshelf um, that you can put together, so maybe maybe we could do that in a minute maybe, if I didn't lose Maybe my if we got like a lot of these and we got more books, we could like make those bookshelves and put on top. Yeah, or you could have like a little. Oh, oh my gosh! Did you, did you lose it? Oh, it landed perfectly. So I got a really cute like this gives me like just like winter vibe because the blue. We're in winter. Bookmark. Did we get Diary of Wimpy Kid before? I'm pretty sure. But I got okay, the, Diary of a Wimpy oh, Kid. Oh, I know we got this and one. And it's hardback, which is <gasps> really... Oh, that's like... Which really, is really cool. Really detailed. I got Goosebumps yeah, Night of like the that. Living Dummy. I know we got this one. Creepy. But never know. There could be like a whole Goosebumps area. Do you know how sometimes people like get the books from the library and there's like only that one? You're like, I wanted that book though. Well, and if we do a books... Oh, I was we were going to save these, weren't we? I forgot last time. We oh, just okay. got the top. Yeah. That's okay. I got enough. Um, yeah, but if we do a bookstore, you want to have more than one copy. So it could yeah, be like a bookstore. Sure. Okay, this is a different um, Vampire Diaries, The Fury and Dark Reunion. Oh, how sad this one's though. Um, I had, before Vampire Diaries came on uh, TV, I had read some of these. Um, and I don't remember, like, well, which, which ones I read or anything. But, yeah. So, Vampire Diaries, which I'm a fan. I got Stranger Things, Suspicious Mind. Cool. I have not like read or watched Stranger Things because I'm not a big fan of Stranger And movies. another Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. So we got a repeat on that. Well, that's kind of, but like, I feel that's like okay. that, that kind of looks fun though. Like, a fun yeah, thing. like we could put, we could put these in a shelf. And I'm pretty so sure can... I got like a shelf or something. <laughs> oh, another, another shelf. <laughs> In me opening bags. It's like a young, really young kid trying to pop the bag open, but you kind of are a kid. Not, well, I mean, a younger kid just popping oh. bags open for no reason like this because I'm pretty sure something went flying over here. But, okay. But yes, it is a shelf. Yeah. This is what it'll turn out. But I really like this. I think you lost your little, um, yeah, these that's pieces. Probably... Okay, we'll get that. Yeah, we'll get that later. We'll get that in a minute. Okay, well, maybe we can put a shelf together and see what it looks like yeah. for them, okay? Um, okay, so we are, let's move on to, do you have a couple of TMU things you wanted to show us? Do you want to do that now? Sure. Or do you have those out or ready? Okay, just a couple couple finds that she got for the dollhouse. This is my purse, so that's why it's so big. So, first thing is a little cute cleaning set it's not like overly like too so realistic. let's look and see what we got we got a vacuum cleaner vacuum or is it like a is that, no washer vacuum washer. Yeah. oh a shampooer and a bucket and it looks like a mop a dustpan so those would look cute in the dollhouse i think yeah for sure i think they would be to scale okay and then i have a cute little red mailbox. This is like 
a dream to have because it's just so cute. It is cute. And we got, because we, you know we have that mail. We do have a Barbie post office that we need to get out um, yes. that I had bought one time. I um, thought, thought that was really cute. So yeah, we could put these little packages in, at, at the post okay. office. My favorite thing, because I really <laughs> love with, like whenever we go like hunting, like for like the place with like the old school stuff. Oh, like, mm -hmm. yeah, like yeah. thrift stores, antique stores. Yeah. Well, I always end up finding old fashioned phones and I'm like, I want to buy this, but this actually move, moves. Oh, okay. So, so you can dial it. Yeah. Well, and I thought that would be like, like our grandparent. Well, that could it could be that, that or can't. you know I have the old Barbie house and that would look really cute in that. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, so let's look at Venus McFly trap. Um, I just think she is quite stunning. Um, um, here's the art on the back and her pet's name is, which I guess is a Chulain. Venus. Julian. 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 Mm. It's Julian. Um, it looks like a Venus fly trap and it says on the back, all of her kind of stats, her little bio back here says monster type down to earth plant monster monster must haves is <laughs> a botany book and hair hydrator so instead of botany which is the study the science of studying plants oh. she's botany instead of botany get it like boo boo it's a oh now i get it <laughs> um pet is chulian to i'm sorry if i'm mispronouncing that and let's see, it didn't say anything about, usually it says something about like snacks or favorite snack well, are or you something. Sure that's not like on the oh, she has snacks. So no, we'll look probably, at that. That's her yeah. boutony book there. Okay. So let's open this up. All right. Well, we've got some things to, to show you. We've got Venus out of the box. What do you think? I think she's beautiful. She looks extra good in green. <laughs> she is green. And do you know why plants are green? Did you learn that science? Sun? Well, sun kind of works with this. Their, their cells are different. And so they have something called chloroplasts in their cells that produce chlorophyll. And the chlorophyll is what makes them green. And we don't have those in our cells, so we're not green. Mm. But Venus I it was is. The weekend. I'm learning new things. <laughs> oh, well, good for you. We should always learn new things. I like the neon green hair oh, with my, the neon pink. Uh, the pink, I know. Those, those that color combination. I've always been like, awesome. I don't like green with pink. Oh, I but do. But that brightness. Oh, I like that. The brightness of the pink and the brightness of the orange looks really good. Orange? Together. You mean the green? The green, yeah. Yeah. So she, yeah, she's got she's got beautiful locks, um, a lot of pink with some streaks of green in it. I really appreciate all the detail that they put in this. Oh yeah, like her little ears on the side look like leaves. Do you see that? Like a little leaf. Oh my god! And then she has vines that are hanging down. Is that from like her. a hair clip or something? Yeah, it's a hair clip, but it looks like a little Ooh. plant that's there. And then she has um, this this sculpted braided section over here on the side. Mm. I know she's just so cute. It says nature on her shirt, and I think I'm trying to think see if that's the that's actually a separate piece. So she has this mesh top with the sleeves, and then this piece looks to be separate. The black shirt. Um, she's got some cut off jeans that have little peace signs. And vines I, and hearts. I think that looks so cute. If that would fit Barbie, that would also look really cute. <laughs> it would cute. look really cute. Those are maybe, cute shorts. Maybe if you took like those scissors that make like that zigzag. Uh, pinking shears, uh-huh. Yeah, you could cut, cut in it. Some, some, some for Barbie? Yeah. yeah, I just think that's a really cute print with the peace signs. Mm -hmm. She's got some veins that are going up her leg. And um, she's got some 
socks tights I'm that a are fan of this one i like that one yeah there's the mesh one over here and then there's one that looks like it's just been kind of cut over here and like even her necklace looks um kind of like a vine or like some briars in a rose mm -hmm. bush and then her shoes she has these vines going up her shoes but look how they look like a like a little venus fly trap or like a little month they're dropping their our book things um like little monster teeth right see how they're like ah. oh, <laughs> isn't that cute i just noticed that gives me dinosaurs. The, those are super cute and little vines on the back of her boots so i just she, she might be my favorite so far she <gasps> is so pretty i know and her eyeshadows got a lot of pinks and yellows in it and then she has her little pet this little, what did I say its name was? Chumpling, chumpling, chumpling. I think you just made that up. Uh, Chulian. Uh -oh. Well, I was close. <laughs> okay, <laughs> if you say so. Um, so we've got the little pet, but then she also came with these little accessories. So I really like some of the little accessories that this this line of dolls comes with, and I think they're really cute too. So her little um, bootney book and her water bottle, which looks, it's really neat. Um, kind of looks like it's it's got some water actually in there. And then her little, it says hydrate, so like her little plant sprayer. Oh, I just noticed something about this book. What? That it opens it just has a little oh does it yeah it just i don't know if it really like... opened or not oh it's got a little it's like, snap it has a it little opens. snap that's kind uh -huh. of hard but look that's cute i don't think that's been in any of the other ones yet has it i was like oh i would because like it kind of like has it lifted i'm like oh I'm that's very cute say that opens and then i noticed it i'm like it opens and we didn't know that a little snack comes with it says bites and Ooh. then her eye coffin um, has all the little vines. I mean, if you can see that, all the little vines and like the little fly trap on the back of that, um, which is really cute. I have the green. Foam. Huh? I have vine foam. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, and then it's all in this like little, kind of like a bucket backpack. So she can carry all that with her, which bucket is back. really, really, really cute. Show them the little shelf that you made that came with the books. Okay, it's a little confusing because I was like, oh, wait, what's supposed to come here? Because there was this well, piece we which had, I thought was supposed to come yeah, here. Yeah, but we had, two, we had two shelves kind of thrown together in the pile, so that's yeah. probably why. But, but you can just keep adding to the shelf. Like, you could just have it, like, for a long, tall Barbie shelf. Right. Well, and that's, that's, that, that's really nice that if... Yeah. You cuz sometimes you know you get these things that we put together and then we don't end up using them, do we? Yeah. Like we're like, "Oh, that's kind of like okay, that's kind of neat, but kind of weird or like little shopping carts that are too small or something." But, but like this <laughs> but this can um, you know, hold the books and so sure. and you can and take this top piece off. Oh, yeah, we got a bookmark too, didn't you we? Can put that on top. Yeah. So, if we put um, a couple more of these just connected them and stacked them yeah. then we could have a nice tall bookshelf because I've been looking for some bookshelves just, for the dolls but some of them are too short get all the books and then we can you know how we're thinking of the idea mm -hmm. like we try not to spoil it I think yeah, that's what I said a bookstore oh yeah bookstore but anyhow I think if we just collected and opened the books then that would mean we'd be able to put books in there and be able to get, make bookshelves. I think Yeah, I think that I like this. I like that it came with a book. I think coming with a bookshelf is a good idea. Very good. Yeah, I like that. I mean, what are you supposed to do with books? Just set them somewhere? Well, I mean this, you know, some people don't I mean, we always get stuff for the dollhouse, but some people just like tiny things, and they think that. I love miniature. Well, things. these little miniature things are really cute, and all I want is some miniature books. I don't want them for the dolls. I just want miniature books to look at, and they can put them on the shelf too. 
and then our dolls could like use this. Me liking the miniature scissors because when we go out somewhere and I buy something, I can't take the tag off. Well, they probably don't know what you're talking about. You can show them your miniature scissors if you want to that you got. Um, but this would also look really cute like in Chelsea's bedroom or in the toddler bedroom or in our Ooh. new silicone baby's room with some <gasps> little mm, the children's that looks books. So cute. I'm hoping I get some, I, I have some more of the babies ordered. They're just kind of backward. I would love to get the little children's books for those. That would be oh, yeah. super cute. Um, it came from Timu, but it comes out, spalled out, but you just pull this, you have it close, you pull it up, then it turns into little scissors. This would be handy to keep in your purse. Oh, for they? sure. We might, have, we might have a doll that we buy somewhere and that we want to get, get out of the box or something on the go. Yeah. Okay, so we um, looked at <laughs> Sophia's Timu haul and our little mini books, and we were talking about um, our Monster High and trying to decide, like, you know, now that it's January and kind of looking back, it was a great year for dolls, and I'm trying to get my older dolls in the doll room here, and I keep getting so many new ones that I just, I, I have stacks of things that I even feel like I still need to open. So we were talking about what some of our favorite Monster High dolls were. And mm. you said... Dracula. Um, she was the first... Um, she was the first Skultimate Secret one. Yes. Um, but you like... Soft I think feel like you like all the Draculaurs. I, I like all the Draculaurs. Draculaura is my girl. I, I just like the way she like dresses... And I've always been like a girl who wishes but vampires were kind of a thing. Because I, I mean, vampires I kinda, are my favorite monster. Because I kind of want to turn into a vampire. <laughs> but I want to turn into a vampire that eats fruit. Oh, well, that's true. Her there are fruit so bats. so soft. And I just like her color black and pink. She inspired the black and pink look. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I got out too. Um,. Gulia, this is just the basic playline Gulia, oh. but there was something about her that at first I was like, you know, she's just, she's just the core doll. Um, I say just the core doll. It doesn't sound very flattering, but I was, you know, thought, well, she was cute and I'd like to have her. But yeah. Then after I got her out, I don't know, there was something about her. You know, sometimes you just look at a doll and you think, that's really pretty. And I just felt like she was really pretty. I really like her hair because mm -hmm. my dream is to have short hair. I want it to be blonde, but I want blue in tips. Okay. I already have um, a Well, hair. and her hair is really, really soft and it was really shiny. Ooh. And I liked how it felt right out of the box. And I don't know. There's something I feel like that's stylish about her. I just really liked her. And then my... um. Other one that I really liked um, was, um, help me out here. Snowy daughter. <laughs> Abby, oh my gosh, I was having a moment. Abby Bominable. I like saw her, you know, like they released some pictures of her and I just looked for her for so long and then I would, she would pop up on Amazon and be like $50 or something crazy and I'm like, I'm not doing it. And then, like, I just waited and waited and finally got her. And I just thought she was so pretty. Oh, and her her hair color is so pretty. She has cute little horns. And she does have little horns. She has cute little horns because she's an abominable snow monster. But I think part of it was just waiting for her. <coughs> but I love her colors. And I yeah. just, I don't know. I'm I just really, really loved her. I'm so, a of the fur jacket. It's like a yeah. little... Too like, much. It would have been cute if it was like more still like more like it's stuck kind of together ish. Like the, you know? these pieces, like it's a little too fuzzy for you. No, like all of this is kind of like matted down. Oh or yeah. Something. Yeah, I would have been like if it were like more like soft like hairish. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like a shorter. Oh. So I don't know. I like I said, I really so I I some of our favorites. For you. Okay. What? Well, Oops. In two thousand twenty-three, did you like? Um, Rainbow High, Monster High, Barbie, or Illies. <sighs> which was, which was, was your favorite? Which? Which line? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, I would have to say mm. what I 
Oh my goodness. I I like I like them all, obviously, is why I've went so crazy. <laughs> probably, and they can't all they can see is the feet, but probably my Barbie movie dolls were my probably favorite line from 2023. Ooh. I like went so crazy. I was like, oh, I don't need that one. And then I'd be, oh, well, yeah, I do. It. Yeah. You need it. And, and we can't forget Little Mermaid, all the oh, Little yeah. Mermaid dolls and all the beautiful sisters. She was sisters also a really good That came out one. with her. So, um. My favorite was Monster High. The, um, um, you need the keys to open. Oh, it's Ultimate Secrets. Yeah, it's Ultimate Secrets. And you know, they're going to have <laughs> ballet ones. And you're you, joking and you're a dancer so you're joking. You know. okay well i think that that's all for tonight we like looked at our books and we looked at our venus mcfly trap and we looked at a few things that sophia got from timu to add to timu. the dollhouse and so we just really really appreciate you hanging out with us um if you like doll content and just like to hang out with us on a friday night in the doll room and talk some doll stuff we would love to have you and we want to tell you that we really really appreciate all of you that have subscribed to our channel it just means a lot to us yes um, very much we get so excited when we see a new subscriber and we're like yay we got another subscriber that's and I so think, great like, when you just have a celebration every subscriber su subscriber we get because it's like well, it's, it's hard to get subscribers it's like well I, but it's just like having another doll friend to hang out with us. Yes. I, I, we really appreciate that. Um, if you haven't subscribed to our channel and you like this kind of um, content, please subscribe to our channel and um, don't forget to ring the bell and give us a thumbs up. And we are also on Instagram at Sophia underscore, uh, Nene underscore Sophia. So just if you look up Nene and Sophia, you can find us on Instagram and we put like a lot of doll pictures and things from the doll room on there. So we'd love to have you follow us on there too. And no matter how many trips that you've taken around the sun, take time to play and have some fun. And until next time, this has been Nene. This has been Fia. See ya. See ya.